destination for personal um, we always go to St. Bart's especially with my daughter it's a great place to just be with the family be on the beach and you know the island really well so there's no surprises yes yeah. which is always great especially when you have a kid and so what when you are away what do you miss most about um, home um, I miss I miss my family, like, you know, having my mom, especially with the child. You know, I miss my Australian family, and then I miss um, the Australian lifestyle, you know, being able to go to the beach, the food, yeah. the about, just things like that. And tell me a little bit about your daughter. She's so gorgeous. She's really like one of, she's just recently turned two, and she's a real tornado. Everywhere. She's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> and she's picked up these, like, little phrases, like, I must... I must say this all the time, but every time she's not, not allowed to do something, she like puts her hands in her head and she's just like, oh God, oh God, I don't do that, stop, who does that? What's your favorite thing about motherhood? Um, just watching her milestones, really, and watching her just grow and her personality come through. Like as she gets older, you see more and more like her feistiness and yeah. just her curiosity and or things like that and what she's interested in you know mm. so it's fun to like see the little person she's going to be and what's a typical day for you in New York um typical day in New York um, if I'm not working yep then I'll probably have breakfast with Lila take her to school yep and then while she's at school I might hit the gym yep. and then work out and steam and then go grab her from school and then we'll just have lunch together, maybe go out for lunch and then either go to a park and have nap time and just like hang out and do mom stuff. But then if I'm working then I'm probably up at five and yeah. on set at five thirty. So, you know, it just constantly changes. It makes it difficult. You find a balance. Yeah. <laughs>